got to see you smile today, though. Lexi's had uh, quite a long journey. Um, I originally uh, performed a heart transplant in Lexi about six years ago. And Lexi was doing extremely well. And then she presented to the hospital in May of 2013 in shock and in profound heart failure. What will you do to make sure there's no air bubbles? We decided on placing the Syncardia Total Artificial Heart, which seemed like the best option for her. And so she's recovered amazingly well over the, the course of months. 332 days. Oh my She's the youngest person in the world to receive, to, who is on the Syncardia, who is on the Freedom Driver, which allows her to be mobile and to be discharged home. So I believe she's the youngest patient to be discharged on the Freedom Driver. What I'm looking forward to doing when I go home? Nail shop. Movies. Out to eat. And shopping. I know the team that works with her is an awesome team, so I knew it was going to come. So it was just when the day comes. So, and it's finally here, and I'm smiling, I'm happy myself. They are a PICU family. It has been a life-changing experience. First of all, I didn't even know things like this existed. And then it is got life going on in my baby while she waits for a heart. So it's like, it has been an experience. My hope is that she can lead as, as normal a life as she can until we get her next heart.